the car is really special because this time we decided to work together with an outside designer, one of the best designers in the world, Russ Lovegrove, and we worked together, we gave him the car to play with, and he did an incredible job because in many ways, he played not only with the vehicle, the exterior, the details, he played with the materials, he played with light, and he created an interior that's truly fantastic, which is very simple, inspired by nature, using all kinds of new digital uh, production technologies, and in the end, I think the result is stunning. I've been an admirer of Russ's work for a very long time. He's, uh, his work is very intelligent, it's very beautiful, it's very sensible, and I felt that his work has a strong link with what we are trying to do in Renault, being a more human-centric company that is very inspired by sensual beauty. And also, through Ross, we managed to get our way into a much broader audience, an audience that is not just interested in cars, but an audience that is interested in design in general. Of course, it's important for me that the DNA of the brand is firmly inside my car. It's not me coming and saying, I want it this super organic shape and we have to accept. Maybe that'll come later. What I've enjoyed about this project is the sort of, um, I wanted to create a, a sort of a mystery on the outside of the vehicle. When you open the vehicle, wham, it's this joy of experience of being inside a sort of a liquid, organic human architecture. What you see in the work I'm doing now with this car is it's a beginning of a whole new way of thinking uh, of how we use materials, how we reach to people, how we deal with the planet, how we give a language to an electric vehicle.